Hey everyone, I'm King Pyro 44 and today we are going to be talking about the top 5 heroes I think you should be playing in Season 3 of Competitive Overwatch. Of course, Season 3 has begun and some changes to the rating system have been made. I made a video on that a while back and I'll put a card for it in the top right corner so check it out if you need to. Before we get started, I just wanted to say that this is a list I made from playing around 8 hours of Season 3 and seeing what heroes have had the most success in my eyes. You may disagree with me, and that's okay. Just let me know in the comments down below what you think should be the top 5 heroes you should be playing in Season 3. So, to start off, number 1 is D.Va. D.Va is really, really good in this patch, and because of that, I'm seeing her being played a lot. She is much stronger than she used to be with that big 600 health pool, and with around 400 of it being armor, she's a tough nut to crack. Her abilities like Defense Matrix also help with some of the other really good heroes for this season and her ultimate is really nice at keeping people off of the point or getting a large amount of kills very quickly. Next at number 2 is Zarya. Now Zarya was actually nerfed this last patch but it wasn't really too big of a deal and actually I think it helped balance the character a lot. Her ability to shield herself and allies while gaining bonus damage is still amazing and her ultimate has potentially become even more dangerous with heroes like Sombra being able to shut down the enemy team's abilities. Okay at number 3 we have Lucio. Now Lucio has been the support since day 1. He is not going away. The AoE heal and speed boost are just too strong not to have on the team. His boop is great on maps like Iluis and Nepal. And his ultimate is a huge lifesaver, so Lucio is definitely one of the heroes you want to be playing in this season. Now coming in at number 4 we have Soldier 76. In this recent patch, Soldier has seen a nice buff and is really putting down some nice damage with a buff from Mercy. He is a force to be reckoned with. He also has the ability to help the supports out by providing an AoE heal for his teammates, so my advice is to stay out of his sights. And last but not least, number 5 would be Farah. Farah has also seen a nice buff in the latest patch and can stay in the air for pretty much the whole game if used right. The damage from her rockets are really really good as well and with teams being packed together, you can take out a lot of people at once and her ultimate is also really dangerous when combined with the likes of Zarya. So two real quick honorable mentions would be Genji and Mei. Both of these heroes are still really strong and can be a mess for the enemy team to deal with. Well that is my list. Let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. Let me know your list of heroes to use in Season 3. Also like the video if you did and subscribe if you haven't yet. I have a ton of guides and videos to watch on the channel so go check those out as well. I'm King Pyro 44 and I'm out of here. Peace.